With memory storage, there are two types of learning. Rote learning, which relies heavily on repetition, and meaningful learning, which uses strategic prior knowledge and connections to retain information. Rote learning is attempting to learn something without attaching meaning to it, oftentimes repeating something over and over again, kind of like trying to cram during passing period before your big history exam. Usually this type of rehearsal learning is used within a short time frame, typically a few minutes or less. But once the information is rapidly stored and used within the short time frame, it's hard to remember it in the long run. Meaningful learning is where learners use prior knowledge to embellish on new ideas. This is the same idea as scaffolding where we introduce new ideas based on the concepts our students already know. There are three forms of meaningful learning that combine together into a meaningful whole. Elaboration is how learners use their prior knowledge to embellish on new ideas. Some ways we can challenge our students is by pulling that information from their brains by implementing activities where they summarize what they have learned or have them connect to concepts through personal experiences. Internal organization is how learners make connections among new information and from an overall cohesive structure. Concept maps are a great way to visualize this form. Think of a center topic that webs out to subcategories, which then webs out to subtopics of the subcategories, and so on and so forth. Speaking of visuals, visual imagery can help learners retain new information by pairing ideas and concepts with physical pictures and imagery in their heads. When a certain vocabulary word pops up on a quiz, students might imagine two arms shaking to remember armistice means an agreement made by opposing sides. As teachers, we should encourage our students to engage in meaningful learning whenever possible. Being able to build off prior knowledge, conceptualize information, and tag meaningful imagery will help students remember and understand any content they learn.